Yeah, the boys are back in town She's addicted to the melanin Golden brown, golden brown It's funny how the tables turn around She told me to leave, she's missing me now Operator, turn up the sound Mix me down, mix me down Hey y'all, come with me to my trip to Puerto Rico. That's me at the airport. And when we get there, this is the house that we stayed in, y'all. House 10 out of 10. I loved everything about this house. It was very spacious, very nice. This is the room that I stayed in. And this is the bathroom that was connected in our room. It was so nice. And then this is the backyard. It had swings. It had the little patio. It had a basketball court, the fire pit. And it had a bar y'all it was really really nice like this house had everything you can imagine even the pool i was so pressed to see that because i was damn sure ready to get in it because it was so hot out there y'all and then i just thought this was really nice seeing that view and seeing the trees and seeing the coconut trees like y'all like there was nothing but a beautiful view there and then right there, we was catching the sunset because later that night, we got dressed because we was going to Fogo de Chayo. This is my first time ever eating there, y'all. And when I say 10 out of 10, and then my girls popped out looking real cute. Everybody was looking like some baddies dressed to impress for my girl's birthday dinner. That's what we ate, y'all. And I want to say the food, 10 out of 10. And then look at me over here trying to get my Happy birthday to Happy you. birthday. Happy birthday to you. My birthday. Happy birthday to Tiffany. That night was her birthday. Happy birthday to you. And we all had to take a cute picture because all of us look too good to not take a picture. And we had got some of the city lights. So next day, we in the car, just riding around, getting a view of San Juan. And when I say, y'all, this was atmosphere was so pretty. Like, look at the water. Like, look at everything. It was just so nice. It was hella traffic, though. <laughs> hella traffic. But it was so nice. Like, look at that. And then look at the streets. The streets in San Juan, y'all, is tiny as hell. Like, it was so hard to drive. Oh, and then, like, oh, look at this. Like, it's a big-ass line because we were oh. trying to park oh, the car. Oh, because we trying to park. Like, and everybody oh, was honking going off at us. So we just started yeah. saying, fuck it, we just about to go to the beach. And when I got to the beach, y'all, it was so nice. Like, every view in San Juan is so pretty. And then I had to get, like, some boomerangs of me in my bathing suit because I did not take no videos, y'all. Like, only me. But... Yeah, that was me. And then I had never, y'all, seen clear water in my life. So when I was like, oh, my God. And then we went to go get something to eat at some place. And, y'all, when I say the food was nasty, zero out of ten. I do not recommend. That was nasty. Then later that night, we decided to go to the club. And when I say it was good vibes in there, y'all, it was really nice. Like, I didn't expect it to be. I'm thinking it was going to be some... Like, it was going to be trash. And then they had strippers. And I was like, oh, let me see, girl. Let me see. Because, yeah. Like, all right. I was like, okay. So, y'all popping in there a little bit. I didn't expect that. And then, of course, you know, we had to get some drinks and stuff like that. So, at this time, we in our jam. We vibing. As you can see, like me, I'm... <laughs> I'm in my groove or whatever. So then we go into the next day. We went to this nice brunch restaurant. And I, when I say this view and when I say all of that, like you can see everything. Rooftop bar. When I say it was amazing, the ambiance was everything. And that was my girls. And when I say... The food, y'all, 10 out of 10, but customer service, 0 out of 10. We waited like damn near two hours for our food. But when I say we got our food and when I say that food was amazing, everything. After that, we decided to go just explore some more of St. Juan and go catch some more views and just go see other parts that we didn't get to tour the day before. And I was just looking at, I'm like, oh, my God, these palm trees. Because, like, this is, like, my traveling era. Like, I said, I'm just so 
into these vibes and at this point it was hot as shit and i was just like oh my god but then we went and at that moment y'all i just was so happy to be there and just have this experience and get to see these amazing beautiful vibes like and that's when we went to go tour more of the streets because at this point i wanted some souvenirs i just wanted to see some more stuff and i was like oh this little eatery eating eatery is so cute and then at this time we outside and we looking at statues and but long and behold i'm like i think that statue is moving and whole time y'all it was a man dressed up as a statue talking and i was like oh my god like, and at this time, we was doing some pool vibes, but then I was like, I want a coconut. So me and the other girl, Deja, were climbing down <laughs> what I showed y'all early in the video because I said I wanted to try a coconut. So we trying to get the goddamn coconut from the coconut tree. So we used the pool that you use to clean the pool or get the leaves out of the pool because I really wanted a coconut. <laughs> and you see Deja trying to squat down and make sure that the coconut do not fall on her. And I'm over here risking my life trying to get one. <laughs> like... Oh my God, I don't know what I was on that day, but I was determined. And baby, I ended up getting one and I was so impressed, y'all. I was like, son, it took like 10 to 25 minutes. And then you see me try and get another one thinking I was going to get one. Then I ended up hitting my goddamn city and I was just like, you know what? That's too much. Then that is the coconut. That was my first time trying coconut and it tastes like nothing, honestly. Then the next day, we just decided to get some food and we wanted to go to the beach. So this is just us at this restaurant. And y'all, it's like a little Chinese restaurant. And when I say 10 out of 10, like, girl, y'all, dumb fucking fried. We had got combination fried rice. And when I say that shit was busting, it was busting. Then after that, you know, I had to go get a souvenir. I had to get some for me and my little family and whatnot. And then we was getting ready to head to the beach. And then I had to get a snapshot of me. I was like, okay, it's hot as hell. Look at that tan though. So this is us at the beach. And when I say it was so pretty, y'all, at this time it was starting to get dark. And me and my girls in our bathing suits. And we was all just chilling so we was like let's go get something to eat let's go find something to do so we was just touring y'all we was just basically doing a lot of touring and just seeing the city lights and seeing how the nightlife is out there so we just decided to go get some food get some drinks and as you mean i had to get a shot you know birthday shots on the house and then at this time me and Stephanie decided to stay up because we was like let's make a campfire but Lo and behold, we could not get no fucking campfire. We could not get that fucking wood to light for nothing. We put a whole bottle of whatever you light a fluid, and that shit was just not going for it. So the next day, which is our last day, we decided to go and get some tacos. So it was this place called Tacos and Tequilas, and it was connected to this resort, y'all. It was so nice. When I say 10 out of 10, but the food was not a 10 out of 10. That shit was 0 out of 10. That shit was trifling. But the resort, baby... When I go back to St. Juan, I'm definitely staying there. Like, it gave all the vibes that it gave. Like, it was definitely a vibe. Like, y'all, look at that. Like, it was people at your service tending to you. It was so many different jacuzzis and pools that you can get in. And we was just walking around. And at this time, we were just getting our last little views and saying goodbye because at this time, we're getting ready to leave. But St. Juan was definitely experienced. I would definitely go back again just to do some more activities. But when I say this vacation was everything, I cannot wait to go back. But thank y'all for watching my video. See y'all next time. Bye.